Say all right, so first and foremost, when I give all praises and all glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, by Hashem, by Hashem, by Hashem, we say that when it's a person that elders are great, most of the world, or teaches a person the truth, and we say salutations, so they act and we say the word in our truth and sincerity, day in and day out, you know, constantly in season of season, we say shalom. And you know, once again, going into the video here, but just on the part of the screen, out before I start the video, right? Um, you know, if you hear abundance and noise in the background, you're hearing things in the background, it's because bad weather. You know, in the Caribbean here, we're going through what they would call the hurricane season. And it's been a pretty rough hurricane season. You know, hurricanes been um we had one major one recently that passed through. Right? And right behind it, it have two more coming up that's causing a lot of tropical storms and all these things. Again, we know we know what the Lord say go visit us through the um tempest and so on. Right? All these things is prophecies and it's been bad. You know, we recorded our um the Caribbean has recorded its first ever in history earliest hurricane ever right which is beryl and i believe right now it's a category five that's going to hit some other caribbean countries and it's heading to america right now nonetheless um going into this video here now it's basically a go going into a video how these all the leaders of these people cause into error right the whole how easily it is these people are deceived when it comes to following these these so-called leaders right because this video, you know, I wish I could play the video, but I'm going through some um, internet problem due to the due to the weather, right? And it's literally Kamala Harris talking to to this actor here and and talking to them about certain stuff. Now the the, the video pick up um, picked up some traction, and people has been to, and people have have been talking about it. Just like this particular post here, it say always the entertainment class, never the intellectual class. Why is that? So he's asking a question: Why do they? Why do the politicians they run to the entertainment class and not the intellectual class to hold a debate or to talk or or whatever it is? Right. The second person comment is they avoid letting true intellectuals interview these people because it would expose them. Instead, they choose entertainers. Sorry. They choose entertainers, rappers, and athletes to discuss important issues affecting you and your families. They should be offensive to everyone. And if he is an intellectual, they should know that these politicians is all they all off. They, they, these politicians are not even some people they're supposed to be listening to. Because they all have to follow they are they have they all have to have to follow the agenda of the elites. You understand? They may look like you, right? But they don't care about you. Right, but nonetheless, so they ask. So the so the question was asked, you know, why do they go? Why do they go to the entertainment class, right? They're supposed to mark. Instead, they choose entertainers, rappers, and athletes because they know that is what Jake like. Jake love those things. They love the entertainment. They love the they, they love the the bacchanal. They love the, the the they love that. You understand? Those kind of shit is what they love. They will follow it. You feel the elites know that? That is why they put, that is why they go straight to the entertainers first. Because whatever they say, you all follow. For example, you all, you all heard a rapper say, don't judge me for years. God say, God, God say don't judge. And you all run with that. You all run with it for years. But when they go to the scriptures, that is, not, that is far from the truth. So they know making an entertainer, making these rappers, these, these actors, you know, these athletes, do certain things they know you all would follow they know you all would eat it up right because you all watch them as your modern day your your leaders you understand just like for example for years you've been following didi you all, you all heard the things that didi been doing for years but that's because that's who all you all look up to you understand that's who all is set as all the leader you all bypass that or all the stuff come on now and you're still trying to forgive him. But they know running to these entertainers, running to these rappers, these actors, and so forth, you all listen to every single thing that they say. You all do every single thing that they do. They know that. Right? Majority of Jake would 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 listen to what these, these rappers say and do. Especially these youths coming up. Let me bring this piece up here. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 9, verse 16. It says, For the leaders of these people cause them to cause them to, to err. Right? And they that are led of them are destroyed. 
right? Let me read over that, sorry. They say, for the leaders of these people cause them to err, and they that a lot of them are destroyed, right? And that is where it is. The, the leaders of those people cause them to err, right? Obviously, these the leaders in, in turn only the truth. They're not leading only down the right path. And they will never lead only down the right path. This, this is who you all set up to be all the leaders. Who it is, these the, is the people all the set up to watch, to follow, and abide by. But the only path they, they lead in you down is the path of destruction. Is the path of being destroyed. Because these, these leaders here, the only, these people here, that's like, that's like Taraji here, right? And just like these rappers, Lil Wayne, these, these other rappers, Drake, whoever it may be, who, who you all look up to, they sat there to fulfill our agenda. You all eat it up. You all eat it up every single time. What do you think that they promote? They promote, they promote sins. You understand? They promote idolatry, idolatry. They promote um they promote um, um, um abundance of uh, abundance of other sins. You know to name it I name so much. Name so much. They're all smoking, they are all smoking out that drugs and so forth, destroying all their mind because again they know the elites know hey, just give these entertainers it. And they would follow. Because this is who they set up as the leaders. This is who they, they watch. This is who they, they promote. This is who they, they take the word. They take the word for why? Because hey, these people have money. You know, Jake, once you have money, they, they, they would listen to. Matter of fact, let me bring that scripture. You see the book of Surah chapter 13. I'll go read from verse. I'll read from verse 22. It say, When a rich man has fallen, he had many helpers. He speaketh things not to be spoken, and yet men justify him. The poor man slipped, and yet they rebuke him too. He he spake wisely and could have no place. So the scripture said, When a rich man has fallen, he had many helpers. He speak things not to be spoken and yet men justify him just like this because why the rich and they know they know uh, is it, it just show is it, it's project baby or something like that is a show where you know some some elites sit around a table and they're talking about jake how they take one out from the hood the others go hate him and then he would hate the others he would try to live amongst them and you know do, those kind of things they know they know why it is they do they do this they know why why they run to the entertainment class they, because they know it's just be, these these entertainers they go and they see all it and you all eat up the words that they that they do watch watch are your watch are these these women they follow beyonce in their eyes beyonce could do no wrong but she continued to leave them down what lead them down, um to, to lead them down astray cause them to err uh, every single time so you say, you say, when a rich man has fallen, he had many helpers. He speaketh things not to be spoken, and yet men justify him. You say, he speaketh things not to be spoken, and men, and yet men justify him. And that is, you just see it. These, these entertainers, these celebrities, they speak a whole sort of bullshit, and men go, men go power a whole thing, peace, you know, trying to justify the shit that he's speaking, the shit that he's saying. The Holy Scripture says he's, he's, he's speaking things not to be spoken. So he even supposed to be saying it. He even supposed to be saying it at all. But when he said, you're justifying because why? He rich. That money. That old Jake won. That old Jake won. That, that money. You know? They say, they say, and yet men justify him. The poor man slipped, and yet they rebuke him too. He speak wisely and could have no place. And a poor man, he speak wisely. And he had no place. You know, they will call him conspiracy theorists. They call him all these sort of things. But when, again, the, these, these celebrities, they look up to Taraji. These, these, sorry, these jakes. They look up to Taraji. 
It's a reason why she went on the BET Awards and was talking all this sort of nonsense about political parties and so forth. Because why? She have to fulfill the agenda and they know that you all would listen to them. It says, when a rich man speak it, every man hold it his tongue. And look what he, what, what he said. They extol it to the clouds. But if a poor man speak, they say, what fellow is this? If he stumble, they will, they, they will help overthrow him. It said, riches are good unto him that had no sin. And poverty is evil in the mouth of the ungodly. So let's go back to verse 23. It say, it say, when a rich man speak it, every man hold it his tongue. Yeah, you see it. They hush your mouth. She was speaking, she was literally speaking a whole set of bullshit on our award show. And nobody in there. She, hey, just hush your mouth. They wouldn't do that. You know, everyone stay quiet and just listen. It say, they extol it to the clouds. But if a poor man speak, they say, what fellow is this? And if he stumble, they will help. They will help. To overthrow him right so let's go back to the Isaiah 9 right so you see for the leaders of those people cause them to cause them to err uh, and they that are led of them are destroyed right and they that are led of them they that are led of them they that are led of them are destroyed you see when you look at the word uh, you see to, to um, be mistaken or incorrect incorrect make a mistake it's a fail to adhere to proper or accepted standards and that's what these leaders do you understand that's what they do the leaders of this of you all that's what they make you all do right i say did that a lot of them are destroyed there is a party all going on those that believe in them there is a party all going on to be to be destroyed you have no in between you listen to a celebrity telling you about politics. Do that make any sense? What you kind of things that they promote? What you kind of things that they do? You know, it's all our agenda and they have to follow it. There's a reason why they talk these things. Because the kind of money they just be getting in the bread. Just like Floyd. <laughs> Floyd Floyd wanted money. What he wanted to do? He wanted to promote. He wanted to promote. Um, <laughs> he wanted to promote those, those, <laughs> those small hats on the land. Want to promote them, had a flag high and so forth because it's payment. And other jigs would follow it because why? They look up to Floyd, he had money, he had this, he had the fame and all this other stuff. It's a reason why they run to the entertainment class because they, they know that that is, that is who you all listen to. The intellectual class, the, the intellectual class, they don't have the money. So just like the scripture I was not reading in the book of Surah, they usually will be poor. You understand? But they will tell you the truth and you all do listen to people that they, they all do listen to the poor, you all listen to the rich. Right? Um, this is Matthew chapter 15 verse 14. It says, let them alone, they be blind leaders of the blind. And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the, into the ditch. And as straight as it could be, it said, let them be blind, let them alone, they be blind leaders of the blind. And if the uh, and if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into a ditch. So that is the part you're all going down. You know, listen to these to, to these celebrities, you know, these as you say, the obviously entertainment class. Let's see the end whether it be actors, singers, rappers, you know, athletes, whoever it may be, that is you all look up to. Because they, they are the bread. <laughs> but the only the only part you're all going down. Is to be the what to be destroyed, is to fall into that ditch, right? <laughs> Just like everything, you really feel when, when the when the when the mark come, they go in and use the, the they, they go in and use the entertainment class to promote the stuff. Just like with the job, what they did with the job, they went to the entertainment class and they had the enter the entertainment class doing videos, doing this, doing that fed. So, in a kind of way. He asks a question, but he should know why they just use it. Right? So, hey, with that, we give all praises and our glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yoshai, Bashem, Kakodash. We say that once a person and elders are great, most of the world that teaches our person to shoot. And we say that the teacher is solely accurate, we say pushing wooden on chicken, sincerity, dean and the out. You know, constantly in season and season, we say, Shalom.